Mom, it's a great mystery to me that the, your two greatest mysteries involve glass. The first one is what you just said. How could the windows get so cloudy and foggy when there's no rain? Question one. And the other glass issue that you have is your windshields, your glasses, you say often, and I understand. How can they get so dirty when I never put my fingers on them and it looks like they have marks all over them? Because the irony, Mom, is that your maiden name is Glosser, which means glassmaker. Are you sure? Yeah, I've never heard that from the Glosser family. is glassmaker well, from glazer. Germany. I don't know where you get the... It's well, you. Mom, what are the first four letters of your last name, your maiden name? GLA. No, that's three. The first four. G-L-A-S. Which is the first four letters of glass. G-L-A-S-S. -S. So we know there's a link between your maiden name. Well, a lot of glazers use a Z instead of a... Um, but but you're, it's interesting that yours uses an S, which is the fourth letter of glass. Well, if it makes you happy, Michael. No, no, no. I'm just pointing out... You don't think that's ironic? That's like my name is Piano Man, and I don't know how to play the piano. Well, if they were glassmakers when they were in Europe, why didn't they continue when they came here? They were all farmers. Oh, no, I'm asking. Is, I'm just saying, isn't it funny that your two big mysteries involve glass and your maiden name is Glosser? Well, they probably involve glass because I love working with stained glass for years. And your glass pieces, Mom, are gorgeous. The Cardinal is over at 007. Right. And what else? Mom, the one in the windows, the window well downstairs, that's yours. Yeah. It, it looks like the famous Mondrian, who's in the Met, or the <laughs> Louvre. You know Mondrian? I've heard the His name. glass pieces. Yeah. Was he a glosser? Yeah. 